Hi and welcome to Design by Teachers. My name's Jess and I will be walking you through how to access your download by unzipping the file. So now you've reached your payment confirmation page or your purchase confirmation page and you've already downloaded your item which means that you have it in your downloads folder or using Google Chrome you have accessed it and it's already saved down here on the bottom. If the product is zipped it will have a little WinZip thing here for Max, for Mac, sorry, or it will also have a zip at the end of the file name. To unzip that what we need to do is drag and drop that on the desktop. So if you're using Google Chrome, just drag and drop it on the desktop like that. If you're using Safari, access your downloads folder and again drag and drop it on the desktop. To unzip your file, you need to right click your mouse. Whether you're using a PC or a Mac, what we then need to do is archive the utility if you're using a Mac. If you're using a PC, right click and you'll also see the option to unzip your file. So click that and you will see that it automatically starts doing that for you on your computer. And once that finishes unzipping, you'll see that it pops up here ready to open. This is also the same for from accessing via your email link. If you start to, if you double click on the link, it will start to download. You just need to find where your downloads folder is on your computer and then drag and drop it on the desktop. Or again, you can right click your mouse and unzip it. So we double click on that folder and out will pop all the different items here. So once you pop that out, you'll be able to access the different uh, files that they've included by double clicking. This is the majority or the easiest way to access the files. Some files do require you, like Notebook, to actually be inside the program. So what you'll need to do is go to your applications or go to your uh, computer access area and actually open the software program and then go to file and, and click open and access your downloads folder where the file will be sitting. So just make sure you keep a name of the file that's, um, that you need to open. Um, if not, it should be sitting on your desktop for you to use. But by going inside the program is the only other way to access it if it doesn't open automatically. If your file is not zipped or doesn't have a zip at the end of the name, you can simply double click your file down the bottom here and it will open up automatically. But that tutorial shows you how to unzip the file if it does have a zip at the end um, or it has a WinZip if you're on Mac, the symbol there. Any complications or any issues, please contact our help and support team. They are more than happy to help you access your files. We also have lots of video tutorials as well as frequently asked questions and a few other items there that we can help you with. So please contact them, they're here to help. Thank you.